I'll never forget my first two certifications. They were Windows 7 Professional and Windows Server 2003. But you know, at that time, I uh, sat down to take the test and I was a little bit nervous. But um, once I completed it and I knew that I passed, it left me with this little boost of confidence that I knew I was good. But now I have that official seal of approval that, hey, you are certified, you are good. I started my technology career accidentally. I was in college going to school to be a marine biologist and I took a job as an admin assistant within the IT department of a local government agency. While I was there, they discovered I was good at helping people, so I became the help desk of one. I then moved into a role as a desktop technician and they noticed I was pretty good at helping people learn new technologies and they offered me the role as a technology trainer. While online, I was doing a little research about this role, what it entails, job descriptions. I noticed in some of the job descriptions that they were mentioning Microsoft certifications. I didn't know about these. Found out there's Microsoft Office Specialist certifications. Started studying up for those and in 2006, I started getting my certifications. I obtained my first Microsoft certification back in 2017. And since then, with the help of a bunch of online resources, such as Microsoft Learn, I kept upgrading my skills so as to keep up to date with the latest technology and to meet the ever-growing skill sets and continue to remain productive. Ever since I started earning these certifications, it opened doors to a large community where I could share my ideas and help others on their Microsoft certification path. And above all, it created a trust between me and many other enterprises. I'm proud to be Microsoft certified not only because it helps me validate my skills, but also that I can help other people understand how to use these technologies and hopefully encourage them to get Microsoft certified as well. I can't imagine what my journey would have been like had I not started with that first Microsoft certification. And a lot has changed in my career. Initially, I was in infrastructure. I moved over to applications and now I'm focused on the cloud. And overall, I still feel the same way. Even though I'm a Microsoft MVP, I've been an MVP for four years. I've done training for over four years now, but I still wanted to prove to myself first is that Daniel, are you really that good? So I scheduled the time and I took these tests and it was the same exhilarating feeling because after I completed that test and I found out that I passed, I knew I am good at power apps. I know I can be a trainer. And that has such a warm feeling because in addition to just that positive feeling in you, you can put that on your LinkedIn. You can put that on your resume and that can give you that little edge that you need when it comes time for your interviews and you're sitting next to the person next to you, hey, you're certified, you can prove that. I'm Heather Severino, and I'm proud to be Microsoft certified. I am so proud to be Microsoft certified and contribute to my community. My name is Daniel Christian. I am proud to be certified, and I look forward to hearing your story.